phone rings. I answered it. It's my cousin, Roscoe. Hey, Roscoe, we're headed to the happiest place on earth, Disneyland. How are you doing? What's up? He was silent and he said, Ron, something tragic just happened. Our 21 year old cousin, Nino, he was hit by a drunk driver. And within 30 minutes, his life passed. Boom, it hit me. How can I be happy right now? We went to Seattle, we mourned the loss of my cousin, but there was this question that haunted me day and night. I commuted three hours of driving every day and I thought, what if I was hit by a car? And what if I had fatal injuries and I only had 30 minutes to live? What would I think of my life? And that's when I saw how empty I felt inside. I thought I'd made it. I thought I had the American dream nailed down. But inside, there was a part of me that was dying. And so that's when I realized I need to follow what's in here because any day could be my last. And that's when I said, how can I be a psychologist? Well, I don't want to go back to school. I know there's this new thing called life coaching. Let's explore that. So I went to school as a life coach, learned to be an NLP coach, learned a lot of different modalities, enriched myself as much as I can. And at the same time, I continue to try to understand what is it? What is the core foundation of how we transform ourselves and our lives? Because I thought it was all out there. You get this, you become successful, you find love, you learn how to create powerful relationships, blah, blah, blah. But what I found is it's not out there. This whole world is so focused on external success, but success is in here.